We Knives budget brand Civivi is featured all over YouTube and Amazon. I wanted to know if the hype was real, so I spent my own money to get these four knives. Let's take a look and I'll give you my initial impressions and help you decide if a Civivi knife is worth being in your EDC. Let's go. I've never owned a Civivi knife, but I have seen them online and they looked interesting, so I purchased four of them with my own money to take a look. So this will be my first look at any Civivi knife. And we'll start going from uh, cheapest to most expensive, starting with the Praxis Mini, then the Praxis, then the Elementum 2, and then the Cadis. So let's start here with the Praxis Mini. Okay, packaging looks nice from the beginning here. Very nice case. See in the case we get a knife sticker, warranty card, a polishing cloth, some advertising information. All right, and then the knife itself. So this Praxis Mini has a three inch D2 steel blade, G10 handles, and OD green. Cost just under $30. It's supposed to have ceramic ball bearings. If we look at the centering, it looks pretty good. It is a flipper. I do like that with a liner lock. Blade looks nice. It's fairly light, 78 grams. Again, it feels really nice. It does have a nice action. We can do a quick sharpness test. Very sharp out of the box. It does have a deep carry pocket clip and it is a tip up right-handed carry. Next, we'll look at the Praxis. Looks like all the same things in the package. So this is a 3.75 inch blade and black stone wash with micarta handles. It was $47. And again, the centering is good on it as well. I'd say it's quite a bit heavier, but it's also quite a bit larger than the mini. We can do a quick sharpness test. Actually, I do like the handles. They're very grippy. The blade does look nice. Now, this one does say it is in 9CR18 MOV. Again, it has the same deep pocket carry, tip up, right hand carry. Okay, next is the Elementum 2. Again, the same materials in the box. Now this is a three inch blade with Nitro V steel with the G10 handles. It was $65. It's a button lock with cage ceramic ball bearings. Oh, that's nice. That has a really nice action. Let's see if just can flip with just the button. We can do a quick sharpness test. Very sharp out of the box. The last one we have is the Cadis. I splurged, I splurged a bit on this one. This is in three and a half inch Damascus blade with twill carbon fiber handles. It was $93. It is a flipper liner lock. Again, the centering looks good. Uh, it is noticeably lighter Roughly the same size as the Praxis, but quite a bit lighter. We can do a quick sharpness test. Very sharp out of the box. Yeah, blade is just gorgeous. Carbon fiber is smooth, but it feels very good. The Praxis Mini is an unbeatable value if you're looking for a small flipper, which sharpens well and will keep an edge with its D2 blade. The Praxis is made for anyone looking for a medium-sized liner lock with a great corrosive resistance in its 9CR blade. The Elementum 2 is a fidget toy in knives close. It is smooth as glass and makes you want to keep opening and closing it. The Nitro V is a nice addition at this price point, making it a real value. 
The Cadis is a work of art. The quality of materials for a sub $100 knife makes the competition worried. Subscribe to get my updates and the full reviews of each of these knives and watch this playlist to find an EDC flashlight to match your new Civivi knife.